Thank you, Andy. By the way, if there are other members of the uh, Board of Directors here, would you just wave your hand so folks can see Board of Directors of the Providers Council out there? Thanks, Jerry. Thanks, Dan. I see a few of you out there. Welcome, and, and thank you for coming. Um, our next um, piece that we're going to do is make a special presentation. Um, each year, we, we give a Caring Bear Award, and I see we have a former recipient over there in a beautiful blue jacket, Senator Karen Spilka. Hi, Senator Spilka. Thank you. Um, and to, to do this award for this special guest, I have a, um, a board member who's going to assist in that, and that's um, Nancy Munson is, I'm look, oh, Nancy is sitting there already, ready to go. Um, so um, Nancy, if you would just do the honors first. Nancy, is, by the way, is the CEO of Bristol Elder Services. Thank you. I'm really honored to be part of this group and to be here to say congratulations to you for all the work you do every single day and to have the pleasure to recognize someone who is a strong force in the legislature and that is Representative Pat Haddad who works every day to ensure that you get the support you need and believe me she knows all about caregiving and she knows all about the work that you do. Representative Haddad is works tirelessly in the South Coast. She works tirelessly in the State House. She's one who always makes herself accessible to her constituents and to advocates like us. She makes our issues her priority. She's the speaker, pro tempore, and has served the people of the South Coast since 2001. She sits on the Rules and the Ethics Committees, and in addition to her work at the State House, she's been a speaker at one of our local legislative breakfasts. So thank you, Representative Haddad, for being a friend and an ally to the human service programs and to our workers. I don't know how to say thank you enough in enough languages or as many times as you deserve. It is amazing to me how you and the Caring Force can every day gather the energy and do the kind of work you do. Um, I'm jealous of all that you do. I, am, I know you're going to heaven way before I do, but I know you do it because it's in your heart, it's in your soul, and it's, um, it's just so important. For your clients, for the families of your clients, um, I am a family member who is receiving services because Bristol Elders is um, taking care of my mother, and I couldn't come to work if it were not for people who care for her and do the things that I have, cannot do because I have to come to work. But I was really thrilled with the whole cheer thing. So this is a rally. This is a rally to make sure that you know that you need to go out and tell your stories. Those stories were fantastic. And those are the kinds of stories that make my colleagues' hearts melt. And that's a good thing, because we got some hard-hearted men. No, no, I'm only kidding. <laughs> I'm only joking. I'm only joking. The, my, um, the people I work with are so fabulous, and, and I just see a few of my colleagues here, uh, Representative Gloria Fox, Jeff Roy, and I know there's people in the back that I can't see, but these are people who care deeply for you, for your families, for everything you do every single day. So could I get one of those cheers again just for yourselves, because you are fantastic. So yay! sure that they know that you need help and you need their help. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.